Yeah, birdie, exactly. Yes! and welcome to a beautiful day here in Northern Ireland. I am at the stunning Loch Urn venue and we're going to be playing the Faldo course. I've never ever been to this part of Northern Ireland before so I've certainly not played this course so you and I are going to experience it together. So without further ado off we go to the first tee. Come on! Right so obviously driver off the first tee it's 286 yards and I'm going to be playing off the yellows today because I just fancy a challenge uh, and also I'm way better with my long clubs than I am with my short so I feel like that is the best choice. Right, here we go. What have we got? Well, not a bad tee shot really as long as I can keep it on the fairway. 286 yards so a relatively short par four so I'm going to back myself and say that I'm going to get a bogey or a par. You heard it here first. <laughs> I don't want to step too far back or end up, <laughs> end up in the wet. Oh, straight down the middle, Jasmine. Oh, did you hear that? Beautiful. Oh, did not see that down. I'm hoping it's good. Didn't quite make it. 50 yards to the pin. I hate these little chips. These are, I shouldn't say that before I'm about to do one, but I'm not a massive fan. Go. Keep going. Okay, that's fine. Probably a little bit short, but we're all good. So those of you who watch my content regularly and have watched a few of my YouTube videos will know I absolutely love putting and I will putt from absolutely anywhere if I can. Definitely left to right, quite a turn at the end. I read in an article that you shouldn't do a practice swing, so I'm just going to try and hit it without one. Oh, <laughs> well, that wasn't half bad. Okay, don't think about it, don't think about it. Just back yourself. Have a look at the hole, put it in. Oh, lovely. There we go. Right, on to the next one. So we're here on the second hole and it's absolutely beautiful. It's a beautifully tree-lined hole, dog leg around to the right, 290 yards from the yellows. And the shape of this hole perfectly suits my slice. So I'm feeling good about this tee shot. Oh, that sounded lovely. Love that echo amongst the trees. And pretty decent tee shot. Oh, I've rumoured tea again. So I've been umming and ahhing about whether this is the best club and Rich, who's behind the camera, reckons it is. So if this goes wrong, you've got him to blame. <laughs> that sounded lovely. No practice swing, just butt. Oh, confident stroke. No! <laughs> oh. oh, a bit of a putting fail on that one. Just after that good hole. Oh well, it's golf. Go, go! Oh, lovely! Tricky second slash birdie putt. I'm not going to think about it. Back myself. Commit. Oh, go on. That's got to be good. Okay, not too bad. I'll take that. Not an easy par putt. Left side. Keeping the flag in. That's where I think it's going to go. Yeah. Oh, straight in the middle! 
Beautiful. I'm buzzing. I'm buzzing with that par. That could have gone very, very badly. So we're here on the 4th and it is absolutely beautiful. So I've had to show you. You've got obviously the water over there, all of the incredible hotel to the right. And if you guys want to know what to get me for Christmas, one of these lovely, lovely houses would be great. always always do this glad I remember that now that would have been very annoying in about three holes time oh not bad I'm on the green get down that hill any turn oh a little bit look at those swans there's so many of them, and little duckies. Oh, so sweet. Right, back to the golf, Jasmine. Yeah, wowza. Oh, that was an unfortunate bogey, I think. Long putt to, to try and get down there, but mm, I'm not happy with that. Next hole, that's my hole. So we're here on the sixth hole, which is the first of the signature holes on the course. And I don't need to say anything really because it totally speaks for itself. And just, wow, isn't it incredible? It's a par five. It's just under 500 yards from the yellows. Pretty, pretty tricky conditions today, as you can tell, my hair going everywhere. But I'm, I'm up for the challenge. I'm up for the challenge. So I'm already teed up and uh, Cue the drone footage. Yes. 250 yards still to go. So I think it is just a hit and hope and get it as far up that hill as I possibly can. Bosh. Oh, that could actually be pretty nice. Just before, I think. right maybe might be on the green might not you'll be able to see oh no oh. there we are So here on the seventh, and this is the second signature hole. And again, you can understand why. A lot more water in sight, but luckily it's not on the hole that I'm playing because as you all know, water is my nemesis. Straight down the middle. It's like DJ Khaled said. <laughs> oh, Jasmine, that was a great shot. Wowza, and that's gone. I think drive of the day, I'm calling it. Oh, that was a little bit of a miss hit. Not my best work, to be honest, but hey, I think that's golf, really. Um, I've got a little chip up here, and yes, I am actually going to chip for a change. Sit now, sit now. Ah. This hole has beaten me. No. Oh! <laughs> oh, whoo! I feel like the wind did that, to be honest. Where is my wedge? 
<laughs> it's so wet. Oh, back, back, oh, it's back up here. <laughs> Done it again. <sighs> Done it again. Just want to bring your attention to this absolute beaut of a fairway. We're on the ninth hole at the moment, and it is, I could sit down on it. It is just like carpet. It is so beautiful and pristine. Also, the weather's quite nice, so I might just, um, <laughs> don't mind me guys, I'll just take a nap. <laughs> across that one. Ah, oh, what a view. Beautiful green, beautiful weather, beautiful course. Oh, can't last more than this. I'm loving this golf course. We're here on the 10th, which is the signature of all signatures here on this course, and it's absolutely stunning. It's a par four, a really tricky par four though. So it's 250 yards from the yellows to the green, which is not quite reachable for me, I'm afraid. Need to do a few more deadlifts to uh, be able to reach. Trusty hybrid for me. Just knock it down there. Bob's your uncle. Yes. What a beautiful hole this is. Although I'm not looking forward to this shot. It's ball below feet, which is going to be really, really tough. I just did a practice swing there and took a little bit of a chunk out of the ground. <laughs> oh, that could be really good. Go on, kick, kick, kick. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. We are not wet. Confident, straight in. Yes, yes, lovely. Well, what an incredible hole. That was absolutely beautiful. But yeah, pretty happy with the two putt there. Not bad chip, it's okay. Um, but just an absolute, absolute pleasure to play. Tricky par four, but if you like a good challenge, then I think this is the hole that you're going to love best on this golf course. Wow. There we go, nice and smooth. Check, check, go. Go, go, go. Okay, that's fine, that'll do. Happy because I nearly hold it. Unhappy because it has gone so far past. I may as well have putted that. Oh dear. Mm, not bad. Yes. Oh, perfect. Driving has been on point today. Just need my chips to match up with that and I might actually be a pretty decent golfer one day. Yes! <laughs> oh, love you. I predict a birdie. <laughs> Just had a Coca-Cola, so I feel like I've got a second win now, and I think it's responsible for this shot. Longer birdie putt than I would like, but I will still take the fact that it's a birdie putt, because, let's be honest, my approach shots today have not been my best. Yep, happy with that. Here we go. Come on. Yeah. 
Birdie, exactly, right. Oh God, 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 God! Yeah! Yes! Oh, that feels good. After some disastrous chips and more three putts than I would like, that feels good. Yes! Now this is a really quite unique and good looking par three. It's pretty tricky mine, look at all the bunkers surrounding it. Love that little random tree there on the right. There's a course in Portugal called Monterey where I first hit a golf shot and I think it's the ninth hole that is pretty much exactly like this. It reminds me of that. That hole I also found quite difficult. So let's see. Oh, and it is again. Oh, now that's a beaut. Sit. Oh, very happy with that. Straight in. Oh, maybe too confident, maybe not. Still in though, nice little par for me. Might be safe, might not be safe, who knows? Mm, bit thin, but I think it might actually work out okay. Yeah, that's all right. It's not left edge, is it? There we go. Hmm, misread on my part. I didn't actually know if I'd gotten onto the green, where it had gone, because I can't see anything from down there. So it wasn't until Rich stopped filming and went, that was a golf shot, that I knew I'd hit a pretty good golf shot. And it is, I'm very, very happy with this one. Tricky putt over that kind of hump there, but I'll be really happy with the par. Even happy with the birdie, obviously. Ooh, this is a tricky putt. Rich has not given me any hints either. Okay, that, yeah, okay, good. <laughs> Is that far right? Ah! Ha! Oh. <laughs> Happy with that. I want to do this one again, actually, because <laughs> I can't believe that. Happy with the par, guys. I'm happy with the par, but I just really want to do that one again. As if. Oh. <laughs> okay, well, it was actually that far right, but good to know. Okay, big one down the home stretch. Straight down the middle. Oh, yes, it was. I think that is now drive of the day. Oh, that is lovely. <laughs> Even if I do say so myself. <laughs> You've got to celebrate the good shots, though. It's been a bit of a mixed bag today. <laughs> okay, big, confident eight iron. Oh, -ho, that was big and confident, all right. Whether it will make it, oh, not quite. Oh, that's good. Oh, stay there. Okay. Oh. <gasps> so close and so now I've absolutely rocketed it past. Okay right edge this time. Bam! Okay plan's not too bad after all. We've just made the Faldo turn so now we are on the home stretch. What a beautiful home stretch it is. This is the 17th. It's it's quite a short par four actually so for once off the tee on a par four, I'm not going to be using my driver. I'm going with my trusted hybrid that has been very good to me today. And that is going exactly where I wanted it to go. Three quarter hybrid. Oh, please stay up. Stay. Oh. 
damn, I'm in the bunker. Sadly, we're on the final hole. And it's a cute little par three. I say little, 150 yards, fair distance, but it's really, really nice. I can hear all the buzz from the clubhouse on my left. I can hear the birds on my right. And hopefully I'm gonna finish with a good score. <laughs> I can hear all the singing going on. <laughs> right, let's step up to the tee and maybe we'll join them in the bar. <laughs> Oh, Jasmine, go on, get up there. Oh, I got some claps as well. Thank you very much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> Here we go. That feels pretty good, looks pretty good. Get up there. Okay. It's all right. Come on, Jasmine. Let's finish this one in style, shall we? Yep. Oh, I think I pushed that one. Four. There we go. Well, not the closing 18 I would have liked, but what an incredible day. Weather's been perfect, a little bit challenging wind, which I really, really enjoy. Played off the yellows to give myself a challenge. Really, really beautifully maintained course. Oh, it's just been fantastic. I mean, I had high expectations of Locker, and I must admit, but they have exceeded my expectations. So thank you so much for the invitation. I've loved it, absolutely loved it. Let's uh, work on my chipping and then I'll come back again and hopefully, uh, yeah, a little bit of a better score. So that's me. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you so much for watching. I know you've not seen me on YouTube for a while, but here we are. And yeah, I think now it's time for a, a drink with the fun guys <laughs> in the clubhouse, and then maybe I'll treat myself to a spa. See you later. <laughs>